you find this? Because all I'm finding is, nope. is it allows me to design, upgrade, and forge weaponry, personal arms, and starship batteries. Ah, uh, well, I might be thinking no of idea. commerce instead. Could be something like the requisition stuff. Yeah, that's proper annoying that I can't like ever get anything ever, apparently. That's like... yeah. oh. You guys feel that a combination of your current general subtlety and the various situations in the hive, there's been some kind of a lockdown on supplies or maybe the dealers aren't trusting you. Bastards. For one reason or another, you are unable to get your gear. Um... We'll keep trying. I'll be back. <laughs> Can you pay a few rent? <laughs> your influence up with XP? Nope. Ah. The nope. only way to increase influence is basically GM award. So the GM has to like you. Whoa. Ooh. You must hate Ooh. us. God. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, I guess I'm closing I'm not, my shopping I'm not kidding. list. kidding. Looking at several other adventures, they recommend awarding you guys five influence for an entire campaign. Whoa. That okay. seems pretty right. shit, I'm gonna lie. Um, no, because them. Um, two or three influence per heresy. Any of you guys doing something? I'm looking, there isn't really much. No, I've run um, my uh, two tests. Oh, that's for look trading at... in. If you're trading in an item that has a negative modifier, that's then flipped around and that gives you a plus modifier to your. Oh shit, we should have traded oh. in all the, all the random rubbish we got. Like crack missiles and stuff. I don't suppose I could re-roll some of this shite I've got. If your item has a uh, a positive modifier, it will give you a try items availabilities. That's fairly character gains up plus twenty bonus. What? Damn it! Where'd <laughs> the weapon? There they are. I was looking for the weapon upgrades. Oh yeah, no, it, it depends on the difference between the availability of the armor, of the item you're trying to get, and the availability of what you're giving in. So if you were looking for an item that has an availability of minus 10, and you were wanting to trade an item that has an availability of minus 30, that would give you a bonus of plus 20. Ah oh, shit, we should, we should have traded in the amputator shells at the same time. Yeah, that's that supposed, to, supposed to could great. do that again. <laughs> well, fuck you. <laughs> Because we've got... Damn it, I'm sitting here wondering if I should try to pick up some modifications for my gun and put them on myself, which will pretty much guarantee I'll get them, but it will also have the possibility of me screwing up my gun for Oh good. shit, yeah, you get a plus 30 if you're... Um, Just getting, getting the weapon, yeah. In fact, I'd have actually passed that, Doug. Because if, oh. if you're getting the parts <laughs> for the device instead of um, the actual device... Like, you basically uh -huh. get a plus 30, but you've got to apply it to, to, you, to the thing yourself. Like, you've got to, like... So you're going to try and apply that yourself? Yeah, so it could fuck up and I could not get it. That's the point of it. But if... if In I that case, you can get the uh, Tox upgrade, then. That's it, man. And Tom, you were wanting to trade in some amputator shells? Uh... I would allow it for your first roll. Assuming it, the difference makes up for it. If you get any parts... What would I, what would I get? Part. What would I get for it? So, what's the availability of your item that you're trying to get? Rare. Is it rare? Amputator yeah. shells. And what's the availability of the rare. amputator shells? Uh, hold on, I'm just going to quick check. Extremely rare, page 167. I'm on. Yeah. So, each amputator shell would give you a plus 20 to your roll. Oh, shit. Each one. So, you need to do two shells to make that test. Uh. uh How many I, shells do you have? Uh, four. Could I oh. trade in one amputator shell and a crack missile? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. All right, in that case, I'll I'll happily take the crack missile. I will trade in no, an I'm amputator shell and a crack missile for my set for my uh, enforcer like carapace. <laughs> Holy I like shit! It. I like how it's like um, I don't trust you. I won't give you what you want. <laughs> like the guy behind the counter, and it's like, Here's how about you now? Very persuasive if you give them other things as well as your general <laughs> script. It's just like he empties his pockets out. There's like a bunch of random bullets, and he's like picking from, and then puts an RPG <laughs> on the table. So. <laughs> I'm sorry, but but a tell me that image. is pretty realistic. As a note for the future, now that I've cheated you over, it might be worth 
trading in your old armor for new armor. Oh, shit. Yeah, well, I, I mean, that's what say... I was doing, basically. Well, that's what I just did, so. Did you? Yeah. Okay, cool. Mention um, me. Honestly, I think all I'm looking for is a red dot laser sight and... Hmm. I think you'd probably be able to find one of those. Are they actually rare anymore? They They're scarce. scarce. They're scarce. They're not common. Is there any... Uh, uh, hold on, let me look up... Uh, where is it? Where are those exterminator cartridges? Uh, they'll be in the ammunition page, which is page 167. What, you're looking for the amputator shells or the exterminator cartridges? No, I was looking for an exterminator cartridge because I was oh, thinking right. it might... You're on about the update, not the uh, the upgrade. Exterminator cartridges 164. Yeah. Somehow I thought they were more dangerous than that. Exterminator, exterminator. It's common. Exterminator. Common it's a half action, you discharge it on an attack. And thus, it gives you a standard action attack with a flamer? Yeah. It's Wait, just a one-shot oh, one flamer. flamer. Oh, it's a flamer. I thought it was a hand flamer. Okay. It's just an underbarrel one-shot flamethrower. So which if there's like is... five guys in a corridor, you could definitely hit all of them. Just set which them is... on fire. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I'll go for that, and I'll go for the, the laser sight. And because they're so low, I'm not going to worry about getting them un... You know... Well, Actually, one. Let me check think, the rule on that. I think if you're buying them as, like, actually, like, like, if you're not getting them as parts, I think you're expected to buy them on a weapon, if that makes sense. What? Hang on. Some characters, like, <clears throat> it, weapon modifications. Uh, some wielders might specifically acquire specially modified weapons or customize their own weapons. Such challenges alter the precision. Da, 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 da. Oh, I guess I do have to, but then that pretty much does mean I'm going to auto pass at least one of these. So let me check something. So we're looking at a red dot laser sight and, ex and an exterminator cartridge, yes? Oh, uh, originally, yeah, but if I have to buy them. You don't. Unapplied, I'm going to yeah. look for something a bit more interesting because I get that plus 30. Yeah, I'm gonna probably try some up some more crap in to try and get my lenses. You really I mean, want for that the exterminator lens. cartridge? It would be a plus forty modifier total. Yeah, I'm just trying to look for the rules for applying the damn thing. It's uh one one six three. Once a character has the parts for a weapon modification, he can use yeah. trade armor skill to apply the modification to the desired weapon. For each test, he receives a modifier equal to the availability of the customization being applied. Is that the is it the availability? Before or after I'm getting it? I think it's... I'm guessing it's before. Uh, because obviously like that, the shot. that one... That would just give you an instant plus 30 on everything, wouldn't it? That was with the shot. If he succeed, if the test succeeds, the modification is successfully applied. If the test fails, the mod not, modification is not applied and the parts necessary to apply the modification are lost in the process. Characters who suffer t two or more degrees of failure damage their weapon. It becomes unreliable. The weapon is previously reliable it loses that quality so you yeah, can you fuck see, your weapon up you see why i hesitated yeah but it doesn't matter for me because i've got a chainsaw and they're like we killed like 10 guys with chainsaws could i oh. go, you've got go like on. a rare ass plasma weapon no, um yeah could that's, I, what, that's why i'm hesitating could i trade in uh how much would two auto guns get me uh, you've already done your two requisitions. Well, I was gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, um, fate my second one. Oh, okay, all right. Uh, the availability of an auto gun is uh, common. To auto gun. Auto, auto is fun. Rarity of <laughs> average. That's a rarity of average. Okay, so does that get you anything? I don't believe so. Give me a second. I think that's. I think that'd be like a negative modifier because it's below ah! zero. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Doesn't it go common average? Yeah, something? no. The item selected to trade in must have an availability lower than the item being requisitioned, uh, as in of a more difficulty. Yeah. Trade in. <sighs> Trading Dara's new laser sight for it. 
<laughs> hey! <laughs> just like, he's like, sick! I got a laser sight, and it's just like, nope, they're going back towards my records. He just loops them back into the vendor. Uh, so well, we try and do the commerce skill. I don't think I have oh, commerce. Shit. God, at some point, I would love it. to get my hands on an Omniscope. Have you what, guys what's... actually looked at what those are? Yeah, it's like yeah. a bunch of different sites in one. Mm -hmm. I do want to clarify again that for all of the skills, except for the specialist laws and piloting, you can do all of those skills just with a minus 20. What would commerce do then? So for every degree of success on a commerce test, you'd receive a plus 10 to your requisition test to obtain the item. And then three or more degrees of success of failure, however, would impose oh a minus 10 penalty. And could possibly impact the warband's subtlety. I am... I... I... I do commerce for Tom. <laughs> do you really? I did, that, I did that as like a test roll and it happened to pass. I expected it to be obscenely low, but I will. <laughs> I'm not sure about that. I don't know, Jeremy, are you going to let that, 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 that slide or...? <laughs> sure, I'll give you a plus 10, why not? I still learn. Um, in that case, like... Uh, 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 what if... I trade in <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> What if I hand him a black orb? No <laughs> Just start trading in Xenos it's pretty rare, right? Yeah, um what if I trade in the next the last two crack missiles? Uh we might need those guys. Uh, yeah, don't don't go throwing away group group <sighs> useful. But material. I can't see in the dark. I need glasses, and I need the ability to see in the dark. I'm useless buy a, in the dark. Buy a torch, you loser. Torches <laughs> it. Buy, buy a availability light. difference. Uh, scarce to. Uh, crack missiles. Why don't you just sell those bullets instead of the missiles? Because we might need the missiles for something big. Well, yeah, because the bullets aren't going to do any help. Like, you you clearly intent on trading away something anyway. We might as well oh, crap trade missiles. away something that's going to be basically useless compared to something they're that is going to be. They're both scarce. Great, trade the bullets then. Don't trade away our missiles. Oh no, no, the bullets are extremely rare. Yeah. Then that's... trade one of those and solve the problem. That's why Doug gave you a massive bonus when you used them before. <sighs> but... <sighs> I know you want to save them for some other requisition. I can see that's what I want to save them. No, well, not necessarily. I want to save them for being able to one shot a big boss. <laughs> they're, they're not that powerful. They're not that powerful. Plus two to damage. I, there's yeah, so many of those. So many not, characters. Not gonna one shot a boss. There's so many characters so far them. though that I hit them with everything I have, and a couple yeah, more damage would have killed something. Two shots. Yeah, no, I don't. It's not gonna You're be enough gonna to do a maximum of four damage if you. If I can hit. Yeah. I can hit. I can hit nine shots in a turn, man. Yeah, but you only yes, have two but you shells. only have two bullets. You can hit nine, but only two of them are going to be special. I have three. The other have, seven are going to be normal. I have three shots. Then trade in one, and you will have two. All you have to do is hit the target again with another bullet that's normal bullet, which you're good at doing anyway, and you'll have done the same damage as firing specialized ammo that you could have traded yeah. away for something sick. Instead of trading away missiles, which we might actually need because of the ridiculous armor pen. Alright, we'll get pissy with me. Alright, I'll try to amputate a shell then. Jesus. <laughs> Alright, cool. Uh, so the difference in modifier is? Extremely rare to scarce. Oh, I guess I'll go look at that then. Uh, extremely rare to scarce. That would be a plus 30, so you got a plus 40 total. What's your uh, trade armor? You are joking! Yeah. 99! <laughs> <sighs> At least you get to keep your amputation. shell. But do I? See, if you had traded in rockets, yeah, we might have lost a rocket. Do we lose it? If the trade fails, do we actually lose it? I don't know. Yeah. Don't mean dog even. Huh? Does, it, does it act as though we're giving them to like? If I fail the trade, do I do I still keep the shell? Or? No, it's not a bribery. It's a trading. 
you know, oh, right. okay. giving so it, and then seeing if they do. That's good. So you, you'll you always get what you want if you actually succeed. And you, you'll you only trade the thing then. Right, well, I don't get super goggles. But Very I do forced. get... <laughs> I don't suppose... Buy a flashlight. I don't suppose that he'll just give me a pack of low sticks, by the way. You can do a test for them, I'll give you that. Cool. What's the bonus? I'm just going to roll from... Oh, sorry. Katarina gets some uh, requisitions as well. Just, just ask her to get you a torch. What's the, bon <laughs> what's the bonus for low sticks? I'm going to guess they're plentiful. <laughs> I know, so. Yo, Doug, what's, what's the bonus for low sticks? Low sticks are... <laughs> uh, Common. I have no idea. Okay, let me look oh, at this. But would you, would, you, be a plus 10. Ugh, would you really put low sticks on the same same thing as bullets, though? Yeah, I, fa I failed. In 40k, probably. <laughs> I failed to get a smoke. Nice. Right, okay, that. this first one's for the exterminator cartridge. And I'm rolling at full value, so the guy has to do the work for me. So I don't screw up my gun. Oh, hey, I got an exterminator cartridge. Whoop. Do you actually need them for the exterminator cartridge? Because you have to remove the exterminator cartridge every time you you use it. Eh, I'm not gonna or, fight it. Or would it? Or would it act as though like you've basically got the mounting attached to your gun now? So if you bought another one, you could just snap it in. That's what I assumed it was. And this is for the laser sight because it's a minus ten. I really did not get that. Um. <laughs> you, you jam your influence. <laughs> That. I'm actually... you, know, you start talking to the vendor and you say you want a laser sight. You know, he's pretty amenable, but then you show him a no, 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 no. Backup. plasma gun that you want him to apply it to. Back up. I, I was actually going to fate point that because that's just insanely wrong. Okay, go on there. Nope, didn't get it. Okay, I'm done. Yep. Okay. He sees the plasma gun and it's just like, nope, nope, not all that. Get out. <laughs> What's your trade armor? Uh, Dan, yeah, what is it? <laughs> Not, uh, trade armor, I've got plus 10 in it, but... Hmm. Let me just check. Fuck it, you've like a 30% chance that you're going to be able to attach this to a gun if I assist you. I'm, uh, actually, I'm... I have higher. My intelligence is 37, because I bought a point or two. Oh, that's fine. Then. Right, I'm going to move to you with the tox thing, and then the the sword and be like, right on my death, I'd like, can you apply this? I will help. Okay, hold on, let me get... Where the... I will give you assist. Plus Hang ten. on, the sheet is locking up. Whoa. GM20, what's this? Oh shit. Even before that's all of our subtlety, subtlety exploded. Yeah, we're in trouble. I, I already know this. <laughs> now, what's the rarity of the thing? It is a minus 20 on the test. Because it's okay, a rare giving... thing. But I'm giving you a plus 10 and you should... Or, well, it should only be a minus 10 for you then. Okay, let's... It's plus 10 to a specific test, not for all of them. What? What? I assume you're doing a commerce, or where's the plus 10? Oh no, not a commerce. No, no, he's got me sticking his toxin in injector on his weapon. Oh, okay, sure. If I fuck this up, don't kill me. Yes! <laughs> nice PC. <laughs> Snaps on real clean. <laughs> Congrats, you now have a that toxin kind of injecting up. sword. <laughs> yes, that's sick. So just test it out, press a button. So like the, I'm guessing the chainsaw is like whirring round and they just like squirts liquid on it as it, the chain passes. That's sick as fuck. I actually remember what it actually does. I'll I'll nod to you in thanks and I'll slide the sword into my This guitar is just gonna nod back like, yep. <laughs> at least I did something. You know, with an expression that kind of says at least I did something useful. <laughs> He's not having a great day. I think we're good. All right, cool. You guys uh, end up making your way towards uh, Strenwell's place. 
Oh shit! Don't forget Easy. Katarina's requisitions as well. So when he comes on, I'll, I'll do that retroactively. Oh. Hmm. So you arrive at uh, the address of Strenwells, which seems to be behind a spire in one of the alleyways. Is where the entrance is, and it, it's not grand, but it's certainly not slummy, not Spartan, or in any way dirty. It's definitely still upper hive, but it's definitely not nobility. Oh, should we check that detonator to see if we're close enough yet? Are we going to that guy? I thought it was the other guy. No, but we're closer to the upper hive. All right. You check the uh, detonator and it's uh, unlinked still. Mm. Where's Tom gone? He's usually the one being all vocal. Is he fucking Tom gone boy? somewhere? Hooks it. Hmm. Give him oh. a minute, see if he reappears, because he'll probably want to talk this through anyway. Yeah. Have, so have a scan through the rule books for a bit. Remember what my fucking sword actually does. Learn what the skills do as well. Remember what the toxic does. I remember reading it and thinking that was really good, so I better get it. It's pretty cool, because like, you get like 10 uses with it. Like, you press a, as a free action, you get to press a button on your sword, and it just like in, like runs the the chain, or your chain sword, through poison. For, and for that round, you get the toxin 2 effect on your sword. Oh, where is it? the hell? It's just, um, it's his mic. He's put his headset down or something like that and left his mic on. And we can, we, we're hearing, like, distorted noises of cars passing his house. What does toxic apply to? Oh, hang on. Oh, it's corrosive. It's like acid or whatever. Okay, that's good. That means it applies wow, to machines as well. Yeah. Holy shit, that's really fucking good. For Toxic 2, for every... Every, um... Num <laughs> fucking hell. Bikes passing. For every, um... Like, number in the parentheses, the targets suffer 1d10 energy damage. Energy? Yeah. Because it's like why? it counts as like acid or whatever. Yeah, but why is acid energy damage? Because there's no acid damage in Dark Heresy. What there so, clearly is. There's an acid thing you're looking at right now. Yeah, but like uh, I mean, like they haven't they haven't got a completely separate damage table for it. So I know I'm being a smart I'm being a smart ass. It's kind of similar because plasma would be different for laser as well, wouldn't it? Like um. Yeah, they both use a shitload of heat. Reduce target energy damage, not reduced by armor or toughness. For example, a creature with toxin 4 would impose a... Alright, oh, they get a toughness test to oppose it. That makes sense. So they get a minus 20 toughness test if I hit them with a sword while the toxin thing's on. Man, I'm and still kind of annoyed it, I didn't get that laser sight. <laughs> That's just sad. Did a really lucky roll. You could have bugged my sword up anyway. Oh, here he yeah, is. Yeah, I know. I still feel kind of bad about the, like the fact that there's a chance to do that. Uh, it's not us. If it had been your plasma rifle and you fucked it up, you'd have been like tears ahoy. That's why I didn't go for that yet, because I like, I've got like no real other weapon. It's worth some. It's worth one of us. Like if you've got that real, if you can buy that skill up cheaply, it's worth at least some um... of the party getting it. The trade I can buy up cheaply, yeah. It, it's it's like the one skill I've got both what's yeah. it's in. Yeah, disciplines or whatever it is. Proficiencies, dizzily wops, whatever the fuck we're calling them now. Ooh, one sec. Waiting on top. Oh, I'm here. 
Well, no, someone oh, else just took off. Yeah. It's a t tremulous time. We might as well take a, uh, let's say, a 15 minute break just to grab food and drink and stuff. Okay. Go to the bathroom and etc.